What is it like living with borderline personality disorder? What parts of your life does borderline personality disorder affect? Disclaimer. Well, I'll say that borderline personality disorder affects all areas of a person's life because what makes people really function and be happy in life is relationship. And most people don't need a lot of relationship. They need a handful of good relationship, good stable relationships. And relationships are not just physical, romantic relationships, right? Relationships are work relationships, you know, societal relationships where you are a member of the community, friendships, extended family members, and romantic relationships. So borderline personality disorder affects all those areas of your life. But how? Well, the biggest place that it affects you is, first of all, is your relationship with yourself. People with borderline personality disorder first of all, sometimes hates themselves or loves themselves. And they have an unclear sense of self. They don't really know who they are. Who they are changes with life and with events and with people in their lives. So imagine waking up every second day or every second month and you don't know who you are or who you are changes by who you are with all right the second place that i feel like would affect people with borderline personality disorder is within their jobs because of their inability to control their emotions i believe that they have inappropriate explosions and inappropriate erratic behaviors at work because they are unable to uh, self-regulate or take that minute to just come down and that can make a work relationship very toxic because imagine working with somebody who just explodes out of nowhere or who takes things out of context or who is uh, suspicious of what you're doing and talking about suspicion I would say that borderline personality disorder people who suffer, people who suffer with, from borderline personality disorder also struggle in their romantic relationships because how do you stay in a relationship with somebody who is paranoid, who doesn't trust you, who thinks you're out to get them, who is out of touch with reality and with what is going on around them. I think those are the three biggest areas that people with borderline personality disorder suffers from. Um, in the next video, I think we should talk about how we can help or we can be in relationship with people with borderline personality disorder. If you are suffering from borderline personality disorder, you have self-hate, meaning that you're harming yourself, or you always have ideation of uh, self of suicide or you thinking about harming yourself or other people or you have intense emotions that you feel like you cannot stand please reach out to somebody in your local area mental health your me mental health you can get help yeah see you in the next video thank you for watching deuces don't forget to like and subscribe